10 simple tips for better health. Now, tip number one is cut out all processed foods, okay? So that means anything in a package or a can. The whole idea is to get your nutrients from whole foods. So think, a quick little tip is just think things that can perish. Foods that are perishable are good because they will give you the nutrients. Tip number two, eat your breakfast, boo. You heard me, don't skip this meal. It's one of the most important meals of the day. And it is a great way to boost your metabolism and get your metabolism working first thing in the morning so you can burn, burn, burn all day. Number three, cut out all the carbs, okay? If you can, try and eat as gluten-free as you can so you don't have a lot of inflammation. And get rid of those carbs, those pastas, those breads, no mas. Number four, no sugar, babes. Cut out all the sugar. It's hard to do, but if you just are, you pay close attention, just really try not to, um, to get any additive or refined sugars into your diet. Number five, go easy on the animal protein. Try as hard as you can to eat in moderation, but if you can try to substitute more veggies into your diet, that's really good. Lean, get lean and green, <laughs> which goes into number six, which is add more greens to your diet, more veggies. I've personally tried to commit to doing at least 80% of my diet, um, dedicating it to just being a plant-based diet. Now it can be very hard to do, but I'm continuing to work at it and you know, practice makes perfect. You just gotta keep trying and keep trying. Number seven, get your arse to the gym, okay? You gotta work out. If there is no pain, no gain, you know, you've gotta work out and you gotta put in the work. Number eight, juice daily. And if you can, sneak in a wheatgrass shop because that's really helpful to alkaline the body. We do so many things to put toxins into our body and not enough to cleanse. So if you can just sneak in a green juice every day and a wheatgrass shop, you're on your way. Number nine, watch your alcohol intake. We all know that wine makes you feel fine, but it is not good for your waistline. Plus it is filled with sugars. And number 10, prayer and meditation. And this one is super key. It's feeding your spirit, mind, and body. This is the glue that holds it all together where you're going to be more present, more focused, have more energy, gain clarity, and feel de-stressed during this winter season. I'm Tyra Magalski, and thanks for hanging out and watching this video. And if you want more videos with health and lifestyle tips, come on over to my YouTube channel and subscribe. Sharon is Karen, so if you have anyone in your life that could use some motivation and inspiration, please share it with them, and I'll see you next time.